Yo, what's going on you guys? Drum Machine Addicts is back again with another highly requested tutorial. And today we are gonna show you how to take your sequences and resample those, essentially turning them into new samples that you can use while you're making your beat. So, a couple of days ago, a user reached out, reached out to us and asked us how they could take a sequence that they've made, whether it's drum loop, whether it's instruments or something like that, and turn it into a new sample without leaving the software. And it's easy to do, so we're gonna show you how to do that now. Let me show you what we have loaded up. I'm gonna press play. All right, sounds simple enough, right? Now, I'm gonna take this and turn this into a new audio sample. There are a couple different ways you can do it, and we'll put some links below to other tutorials that we have that show you some different ways. But the one I'm gonna to use today is I'm gonna use the button in the top right corner that lets you export audio or export MIDI. Traditionally, people use it to export out the software, but you can actually use it to drag over to sample edit. So, let me show you how to do that now. All right, so just that quick, you've exported the audio, right? What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna bring back up our drum pads, right? I'm gonna go to an empty cell just cause. And I'm gonna load that on an empty cell. And you should know, anytime this button at the top is red, that means there's a clip up there that can be exported. They essentially took, they as in the MPC software, essentially took the sequence and turned it into an audio file for you. So if I press the pad like so, it essentially turned my sequence into an audio file. And because it's loaded up on a pad, that means it's automatically loaded as a sample. If I go to sample edit, we'll see it. All right, and as you can see, it's here in sample edit. All right. Now from here, I can go ahead and chop this into a new sample. All right, so. Yeah. Let's play around with this some more. And just like that, you've created a new sample. So this is essentially a way to resample yourself on the fly without having to use the software. And that's pretty much it, you guys. If you have any questions, don't forget to hit us up at drummachineaddicts at gmail.com. With that said, don't forget to tell a friend to tell a friend to please subscribe. And we'll see you next week. Peace.